Can we push the lark cakes tonight? And can we also push the relish? Guinea fowl soup, super tasty, not spicy, pretty approachable. Do remember to recommend those, those dishes, please. All right, nice one. One of the amazing things about cooking in London at the moment is that there is this community of people who are all doing different but really exciting stuff. Chefs from all around the world are cooking in London. A lot of young people are opening their own versions of restaurants. And you add into that all the diversity that we have here and the taste of Londoners for cuisines from all around the world. It makes you think someone else is opening something amazing this year as well. So what are we doing next? Part of the reason why we have a great food scene here now is that we didn't have much to showcase in the first place. So we've always been like a, a canvas for diversity and we've had lots of immigration and we've really benefited from that. I think the diversity makes the customers more open-minded. So that's why London becomes good to be opening a restaurant that's a bit more challenging. The demand is there for a more exciting type of Thai cuisine, more likely you would eat it in the country. That's what people want to eat in London now and people are asking for it. One of the things we do at Somsa is balance using the best of British meat and fish with Asian produce. A lot of the best stuff is not in the most obvious places. It's a little restaurant that's in a back street in Hackney. It's a little market that's down a side street. So the butcher we're going to go to is Hill and Schrock. They are a great butcher and they have stuff that comes from quite small farms, stuff that's really well aged, really well treated. What have you got in at the moment? We're doing quite a lot of things, stuff. Uh, do you have any pheasant at the moment? Uh, Game's a big yeah. part of what we do here at Somsa. So we're always talking to those guys about what game's in season and what would work well with our dishes. Is that it? Yeah, that's very good. Cool, man. Thanks. Good to see you. Thank you. you see you. See you around. See you around. This Vietnamese supermarket is called London Star Night. They get regular shipments in from Southeast Asia, and it's a lot of stuff that you can't really get in most other Asian grocery stops. The importance of fresh Southeast Asian herbs in our cuisine is fundamental. Some of them are things that are really quite hard to get hold of, so they're quite an important supplier for us. Thank you. Tonight we're having a few friends to eat here at Somsa, just like a couple of industry people and friends and family and stuff. I think it makes a really enjoyable experience for a chef, not only because you can see them enjoying everything together, but then you can also go and join them afterwards and make it a bit more of a dinner party kind of environment. Now is a, is a super exciting time to be in London. I actually think it's getting better and better and I've never known it as good as this. Traditional restaurant moulds of how to eat and, and the format are all getting rewritten and broken, and that's being driven by a lot of really exciting, open-minded young restaurateurs and restaurant people. And I think there's never been a better time to, to cook or, or to eat in London.